Good morning, everyone. I'm uh, out driving. I'm in my wife's uh, vehicle uh, this morning on my way to uh, go for a doctor's visit. I was just thinking it as I was driving and I've been wanting to make uh, one more video about Sarasota Tim and you know there's so many things that I could uh, talk about give my opinions about with Sarasota Tim but um, I've realized by thinking about it and also by you know a few comments that have come in uh, related to my other videos that I've made about retirement and and some of the you know based on some of the things that Sarah Soda Tim had said about retirement um, you know some people have commented like you know you don't have to watch uh, and it's true I don't have to watch uh, which is why I um, unsubscribe to his channel now will his video still come up in my YouTube feed probably but I don't have to watch and you know I haven't really watched him much since um, since he's been on the road out west or in Nebraska wherever he's at they're just not interesting to me most of the videos have been you know him at rest stops and truck stops and things like that um, I know he's uh, currently doing some things um, he's met some people out there he's been on a boat or something doing some other things but I haven't really been interested in watching now you know primarily because um, I didn't make my YouTube channel to be a Sarasota Tim Basher uh, if you want somebody to watch that is um, pointing out the flaws the, the discrepancies the inconsistencies uh, of Sarasota Tim then you can watch blind views and the other channel called darling uh, they have some really good um, kind of roasts of Sarasota Tim and pointing out some of his his um, you know things that he said that has contradicted other things that he's said um, I just don't want to do that I you know I didn't really mean to have a channel that's dedicated to Sarasota Tim so I don't want to do that there's a lot of other things that I want to um, have on my channel I want to do some camping um, hopefully I can do some decent camping videos I want to talk more about retirement and you know what what I'm doing today and my view of retirement uh, retirement living and things like that uh, just about my life you know about health more about mental health um, things like that I, I do want to mention uh, some other YouTube channels that I've found very helpful for myself and I've enjoyed very much so I'll probably do a video about that but um, you know so just some final thoughts about Sarasota Tim and I, I you know I know I don't have to watch him uh, you know I don't want Sarasota Tim to be in my consciousness all day long but um, you know there are some things that I've noticed about him recently like his um, obsessiveness of with buying things um, I've seen this in other people and I'm sure we all have uh, people that we know that have been through the same thing maybe still doing it you know this obsessiveness with buying things you know we've all seen Sarasota Tim will you whether you love him or hate him um, we've all seen him driving around in his truck with all those Walmart shirts hanging in his back seat with tags on them we've all seen him buy things send them back return them buy different things over and over and over again so uh, you know my personal feeling is that he has some type of uh, uh, obsessive compulsive disorder and you know if you do the research you'll find that a lot of people that are always buying things and returning things and buying more things uh, they usually have some type of depression so I don't know if that's Tim's case or not I mean he certainly doesn't seem like he's depressed I mean he's definitely enjoying his life or apparently enjoying it um, so I can't fault him for that you know what can I say um, 
The other thing that uh, really turned me off of Sarasota Tim, now I did want to say that, you know, when I originally started watching Sarasota Tim, uh, probably a year or so ago, uh, I thought it was very cool. I mean, he's living in a camper, RV living, there's nothing wrong with that. Uh, a lot of the things he said was made sense to me. I like just the the day-to-day -day videos, but you know, it's it's gotten to be so obsessive. I mean, he, you know, I mean, we all know that he makes many, many videos every day, like films his whole life. So I think he might be lonely, you know. The other thing that turned me off of him was I started to notice how he will say things and then he'll say something like, you know, you can't believe a word I say. And then he'll say, believe me when I say this. And it's just very, um, uh, I, I think it, there's something in the psychology of him that makes, makes him want to put his viewers off balance so they really never know uh, what the truth is. And I think he does that because uh, maybe he's recognized that, that he said things at one point and then said something contradictory. So maybe he's doing that. I don't know. You know, um, again, I don't have anything against Sarasota Tim. Uh, to a great degree, uh, he's doing things, you know, he's having more fun than I am. I mean, I have to uh, be in town a lot to work my part-time job as a yoga teacher. I do need that income. I'm sure I've mentioned that before. I do also collect uh, Social Security. Um, but I'm not ready to just, uh, you know, not do anything. I, I have thought about uh, um, quitting my job teaching and uh, just getting by on my Social Security and the income we have from our uh, online yoga studio. But I'm not quite ready for that. I enjoy teaching yoga, and um, I like the social interaction of it. So maybe by the end of the year, I have thought about quitting at the end of the year. But, you know, really, I mean, I, I enjoy doing things. I enjoy uh, working a little bit. The, the thing that I love about uh, what I'm doing now is that, um, you know, I am collecting Social Security. I started collecting when I was 62. Um, I felt that was the best thing for me because I honestly didn't know how much longer I'm, I'm going to live. I do have a lot of uh, medical things going on, so I was concerned that maybe waiting to 67 or to 70 might not be the best solution for me, and that remains to be seen. Um, but uh, I enjoy uh, doing some work. I enjoy doing creative things, and most of the things that I do are creative. You know, I, I teach yoga. Uh, that involves some creativity to keep people interested in it, to keep inspiring people and so forth. Um, I love making music. Um, I do plan on making some videos about, uh, you know, my music and things like that, a little bit at least anyway. I do like making videos and taking photographs. I love photography and videography. I even like, um, I find a lot of satisfaction in editing videos when I have the opportunity to edit them when they require editing. So I enjoy all that stuff. I enjoy learning new things. I enjoy reading. I enjoy, you know, talking to people about, um, you know, health and, uh, you know, physical health, mental health, spiritual health, uh, things like that. Living in the world. Uh, I enjoy uh, coaching other people. Uh, I do have uh, several clients that I coach mostly on just kind of, you know, trying to arrange their life properly. Um, and I, you know, use the mistakes I've made in the past as uh, help. And mostly, really what I do is I just help people to uh, talk out their own solutions, really. And, um, and then I, you know, try to get them to make decisions about their life. And then I just simply help keep them accountable, you know, check in with them once in a while, uh, make sure they have somebody to help keep them accountable for the decisions that they've made, for, you know, habits that they want to create for themselves. So I enjoy that. And to me, it's, um, you know, maybe it's not so much creative, but it's just a way that I can give back and help people uh, in some way. 
so anyway, um, getting back to Sarasota, Tim, so, you know, those are some of the things. Now, you know, I don't find uh, videos on people just cooking food, you know, cooking bacon and eggs and things like that. Um, you know, it's kind of boring to me. Uh, so that, you know, Tim has made a lot of videos like that. I just don't find them enjoyable anymore. So I have unsubscribed from him. I'm, uh, you know, I might come across his videos and, you know, watch a little bit, see what's going on with him. But I, I do wish him well if he is depressed, if he does feel lonely or lost. I mean, a lot of people do feel lost and they, they don't really know themselves anymore. Or maybe they've never known themselves. And, um, you know, and it can manifest in a lot of different ways. It can manifest as, you know, uh, obsessive compulsive disorder, obsessive shopping. It can manifest as uh, people telling lies and then, you know, contradicting themselves. It can manifest as many different things, you know. And a lot of these people that are depressed, that have these mental conditions, you'd never know it because they try to mask it you know, by um, uh, going over the top with doing things. So um, I just, that's what I see. I don't know if it's true or not. I'm not a psychologist, so who knows? But I'm kind of done with it. I don't want to think about Sarasota Tim anymore. Um, I, I want to focus on the things that I want to do, especially as summer comes up. You know, I want to do more videos on camping and I want to enjoy camping. I don't want to spend, you know, a whole camping trip shooting videos, but I would like to shoot some film uh, uh, of me camping and my wife camping, of us traveling, uh, doing little things, more things about my life and thoughts about different things, different aspects of life. So that's what I'm going to concentrate uh, my effort on. And uh, the final question I have for you, and you can comment on um, in the comments below if you've gotten to the end of this video I know most people don't watch a video all the way through but my question to you is do you love Sarasota Tim do you hate Sarasota Tim or do you love to hate Sarasota Tim or do you hate to love him so uh, that's my question to you I know what my answer is. I'm going to keep my thoughts to myself uh, because I know there's a lot of people that really defend him and really love him, and that's fine. I just don't find him, enjoy find him enjoyable anymore, and um, I want to focus on living my life more. All right, my friends, have a good day. Uh, thank you for joining, and if you've come across this video and um, you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. I'm trying to get to a thousand uh, to a thousand subscribers now it just as a goal for myself uh, I'll have many more videos coming up soon so thank you for subscribing thank you for liking thank you for commenting and uh, remember to always try to be the best human being that you can be on a daily basis and try to uh, spend some time helping others throughout the day on a daily basis have a good day